Hi, crypto heads. It's me, John Disc, and it's Sunday, 6.15 p.m., October 15th, 2017. Uh, Bitcoin has had a bit of a rough day. It's back up where it's supposed to be right now, but um, it's been rocky. Let's go see what the story is here. Today's high was 58.64. That's pretty high. Uh, looks like it hit that somewhere around almost 11 p.m. last night. And not long after, somewhere around 3.30 a.m., it started dropping. So we get a big dip here and go all the way down to 54.45 and we never quite recover here. Uh, we went sideways horizontal and just recently uh, what would this be? 5... Uh, 5.40 5.30 it started coming back a little bit and we had a big a big buy-in Starting then, and now it's back up to uh, 56.37. As a whole, from this time yesterday, we are down 1.84%. That's where we're sitting with the coin of bit. Ethereum. Let's go have a look-see. Uh, Ethereum is down 2.73% and sitting at 334.39. Uh, again, it's a little bit rocky. Pretty much the same pattern as Bitcoin. Um, started rebounding big time somewhere around 9, 10 a.m. But uh, there's a quick sell off at 11.40. Boom. And then another buyback in horizontal, and just recently it started coming back. The coin of light. Uh, Litecoin is pretty much even from yesterday, down 0.17%. So that's not much that we can call that even. We had a big high at $70.04, but uh, didn't last long. Another sell-off starting at about 3.30 a.m. And uh, it's been very volatile. Looks like it's been traded a few times. Now we're going to go see how the rest of the world is doing here. These are the top 10 volume coins. In the first place we have Bitcoin at $587 million in volume. That is a lot, especially because we're, uh, we're starting this early tonight because we're testing some new software. Um, Ethereum is in the second place at 165 million in volume. That's a lot too. And Litecoin is in third at 132 million in volume. Uh, Ripple is in fourth. Metaverse jumps all the way up in the fifth place. Look out, this coin might be here to stay. Metaverse is playing with the big dogs. Very volatile coin. Lots of ups, lots of downs. Real quick happening. Let's go take a closer look at Metaverse. So, wow, 465. Look at this one week graph. It came out of the gate on September 20th. Big rise, big sell-off, long horizontal, and pretty much nothing up but up. But these are big, huge jumps here. This just happened the other day. Looks like from a dollar twenty-three to a two seventy-two. Then an adjustment, big bounce. 
Uh, Metaverse could be here to stay with us. It's up 28.22% on the day. Huh? The problem is you can only get it on Bitfinex. That really sucks for U.S. buyers. Anyway, Monero is in 6th, uh, Bitcoin Cash is in 7th, Digital Cash is in 8th, Omise Go in 9th, Neo is in 10th, and we have Zcash. An honorable mention in 11th place. Biggest riser of the day is easily Metaverse at 28.22%. Biggest tanker of the day would be Monero losing 5%. Wow, Metaverse all the way up to this approaching $5. Just the other day, it was sitting at a dollar, dollar and a quarter. Let's go back to Bitcoin. It's going to be a short video because, again, I'm testing some software. $5,660. Currently making our way back up. This is one hour. This is one day. Strong buyback here. These are big candles. I'd like to see that trend continue for a while and get us above 5,800. This is one month here. This is three months. Six months and one year with the coin a bit. That's about it, everybody. Hope you're having a great weekend. I'm tempted to do something here, but I don't want to play with the software too much until I know exactly how to use it so i am going to end this video right here peace everybody